Hi. What's up? Um, uh, it's me, Toto. Ah, uh, so let's put some music, right? Uh, let's see what was that. Too dark. So yes. Um, how are you? Um, my name is Jorge Orellana, but you can call me Toto. Um, and yes, this is my YouTube page. Um. What happened with the music? Did I put a play? Sorry about that. I mean, sometimes happen. Like, you know, um, like, don't know what's going on, pretending. Well, but that's not the case here. Like, I want to start like talking. Talking about many things. So, um, yeah, this is like, start could be like a journal thing, kind of thing. And I hope you like it. And um, you can like subscribe right here and like right there. So, yeah. As you can tell, I have an accent, right? So you may think uh, where this guy is from. Um, but I'm from South America. Um, my first language is Spanish. Um, and English is my second. So, um, so yes, I'm from South America. Um, living in states for like 18 years already um i am legal so don't worry gringuitos like i am legal and i am a citizen here so i vote i didn't vote for for trump and well that's not the case like about talking about politicians that's something i don't do uh but just for the record i didn't vote for him um so, uh, but I like to talk about different things like, um, uh, when I make videos about like, um, things that I wanted to do, I always wanted to do and I'm curious about, like, you know, I always want to be a dancer. I want to have experience doing that. I want to always do some kind of sports that I never done, things like that. Um, I am very flamboyant and as a flamboyant person is like so hard to do some things because I'm, you know, part of the society puts you in this label and you get frustrated or like intimidated that you don't do. So I will start just like doing it. I don't want to make the F word, but F these people and, you know, I will start living my life now. So, so for now, it's like, um, I also want to like show my talent that I have been gift. Um, I am an artist. Um, I like to do things, creative things, and I want to show you. Also, I want to do, um, fashion. And I want to show you. So I have a lot of things that I want to show you. So uh, as a first video, I will find right now one thing that I can probably start do showing you. And you will enjoy my first video. Here we go. So one of the things that always put me first was my personality. So, um... I am a very flamboyant person and I love it. 
I embrace it every day. I try to make it fun and natural. Um, it's been an issue because I have been bullying my whole life. But now it's, you know, the fact that I, I, I accept my reality and I live with it. And thank you for those bullying. I am the stronger person that I am right now. And I'm very happy. And I will, you know, show you how flamboyant I am today. So this is going to be fun. I mean, isn't it beautiful, these filters? I love these filters with this kind of butterflies. Anyway. Um, yes, I mean, I came out of the closet when I was like, well, to myself, when I was like, always, like, I remember, I always knew, I always, you know, for a while I tried to figure it, find, find another way to fit in, and that was something that I made, that was a mistake, I know, because I don't fit in, uh, in the heterosexual society, um, especially, uh, from my country, like, that is Bolivia, um, Cochabamba is the city, um, it's very conservative, and people freak out, or they get very, so, angry. um, I struggle a little bit, um, but I survive, but that can be force me to think that I need a better life. I didn't come here for suffering, so, uh, but I feel like my country, Bolivia, is not ready for a queer like me. So, I decided to go to come to the, the States to check it out first and like, you know, We'll see if I can, if I like it. And I did. Uh, so I did everything I could to put myself together and with the paper and legal stuff. It's not hard. It's, you know, one thing that you have to do, do it. So, um, and then now, you know, you get like, hot. you know, living in the U.S. now, but it put me in situations of knowing better myself and knowing that I can do anything I want and work hard for it and, you know, not being afraid of who I am. Um, so, um, yeah, you just need to put a lot of energy and just knowing who you are and where you want to go and just do those things and be truthful, true to yourself. Because at the end of the day, nobody will care. Nobody cares about, like, you know. Uh, so you have to be honest to yourself. So accept yourself for who you are and embrace it every day. And everything come up. So yes, that's my um, flamboyant size that you know, um, make me feel young and pretty. Um, but I embrace it every day. Um, I take care of that very well. Um, and um, even though like I feel sometimes insecure because it's a lot of competition in the gay community, uh, but um, you just need to be who you are and be happy. And if you know who you are, everything is more easy uh, and you really don't care about what people think. Um, when you show like you are honest to yourself and you and this is you and you know, you accept yourself, everybody will do. So keep that in mind. Think about it. Like just just do one exercise every day. Uh, first in the morning, go to any kind of mirror and look into yourself and feel and enjoy looking to this person and say that, oh my gosh, you're so gorgeous. I love you and today is going to be the best day ever. Um, uh, let's try to find a nice outfit 
and let's make this the best day ever because uh, one thing that I learned is to enjoy every single minute of my life. So doing that, I know sometimes things happen the way you want, but trying to make an effort to get a goal and if you make that goal, try to do better. Uh, one more is so one like goal. for instance, I, 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 my goal was to cook today, like to make a potato salad than I did. Um, and after I, I finished, I felt like, okay, uh, it tastes good, but it could be better. So what should I do? So that's the way like you, you accomplish something, but you want a little bit better. And then I reach a little bit more and then I added like some chicken and I put the chicken and it was delicious. So, because I need to get a little ass, so I'm working with potatoes so they can help me to get the booty I want. But that's a different issue. Maybe like I will talk next week about my uh, body. So, <laughs> enjoy the day and don't forget to subscribe and like my video.